I'm Max Reyes and welcome to Gonzaga. College Hall is right behind me, which is one of our main buildings here on campus. I'm originally from Seattle, Washington. I am a education and English major. I'm trying to get a secondary teaching cert in grades five through 12 for ELA. And I'm also minoring in our CLP program, which stands for the Comprehensive Leadership Program. So I'm trying to get a minor in leadership studies as well. But today's a Tuesday, and so I'm gonna be showing you one of my busiest days on campus, a little bit of academics, dorm life, my favorite spots on campus, just so you guys get a feel for what Gonzaga is like. And I hope you stay tuned for the ride today. Hi friends, this is my favorite spot on campus in the Humanities Building, the College of Arts and Sciences. It's not one of the main hubs we have on campus like Hemmingson or the RFC, but it's still a really cool building and it's one of my favorite spots just because it's nice and secluded. And as an English major, I spend a lot of time in here just because my English professors have office hours in this building and it's quieter. Let's take a look inside. Hi friends, we are now on the second floor of the Humanities Building. It's a smaller, quaint building. Not a lot of students come in here. It's not a centralized hub, but it has its own fun and cute quirks, like the paintings behind me up the staircase leading to the second floor. Um, the second floor is my favorite spot, which is our reading room. The reading room is this really quiet room where you can get a ton of studying done. It's kind of like a lounge. It's really cool, really quiet, and when it's raining out, it's still really pretty out. Even when it's sunny, it's even prettier. The balcony view is just gorgeous. I love having a bunch of windows and open space for studying. I feel like being in a productive environment is key when you need to study and this place gets the job done. Hi friends, welcome back again. This is the Dillon Residence Hall, which is where I live. I'm super excited to take you inside for a mini tour. friends, we're in Dillon Hall now. And this is the third floor of Dillon. We have a cute little lobby area that you just saw. It's got foosball and every floor of Dillon has a little lobby area with its own game set and TV, which is really nice. This is my dorm 303. This is my sweet mate, Jenna. She's studying right now. This is our lobby space. We have a couch, a little table, some extra seating, a really cute carpet. And then this is me and Jade's room. Jade is my roommate. She's not here right now, but this is our room. We have a corner room and it's really spacious. And we have a really cute bay window. If you come over here, I lofted my bed to the highest loft setting so I could put a hammock under. But that is a really fun feature of my room that I think is quirky and I really want to show you guys. Hi friends, I am back. I am on the third floor of Dillon in our study space, in the little study lounge. Um, every floor in Dillon also has a study space, so this is what it looks like. I have a whiteboard behind me, and a little bit of academic life that I want to share with you guys is one, I study here all the time because sometimes I just need to get out of my room, study in other places like the reading room in the humanities building that you saw earlier. And two, my Tuesdays are my favorite classes. So. Every Tuesday and Thursday, because I'm an English and secondary ed major, I have the opportunity to teach in a middle school to get teaching experience. So today was my first time teaching a full 45 minute lesson, and it wasn't by myself. I had two co-teachers, thank goodness. But here is a clip of our class recording from our first teaching today. That's me. Being able to teach every Tuesday and Thursday at Gary Middle School is one of my favorite academic highlights of this semester as a sophomore. And I just wanted to share that with y'all because I think it's such a cool opportunity for my major as an English and ed major. And there's so many other opportunities available to other students of other majors. And this is just one of the many that Gonzaga has to offer. As my Tuesday night comes to a close, the last bit of my life as a Zag that I wanted to share with y'all was my um, favorite club and extracurricular activity. So I just got back from FASU, which stands for our Filipino American Student Union. It's one of the many cultural clubs that we have here on campus. I'm actually one of the PR reps, so I'm part of the board. But FASU is just a great way for me to engage in my cultural identity as a Filipina here on campus, especially as a student of color attending a predominantly white institution. It's really awesome to have clubs and people that I can meet with on a weekly basis just to catch up and talk about life and our experiences and educate the Gonzaga community about the experiences of Filipino Americans here on campus. 
So I'm gonna attach some clips for y'all just to get a feel for what Fosse's like. What? Hi, vlog. Hi friends, that is the end of my vlog. That was my entire Tuesday in a brief five minute video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and stay tuned for more updates from our other student hosts. Thank you and go Zags.